Hello you Chinese people, welcome to Ersai.com. In this video, allow me to show you a basic tip of SPSS. I will show you how to save your file into your drive. As you know, when working with SPSF, we have two different files. The first one is the data file and the second one is the output file. Let's take a look at the data file. Data file contains the data and the variable that we use into our analysis. So if you want to save it, go to file, save us, and you'll see a save data as dialog box. In the look in tab, choose the location that you want to place the file. And in the file name tab, type the data name. And this is the interesting thing. If you want to create a new file that contains specific variables in from this data, you can click the variables option and you can uncheck the variable that you don't need. If you want to have only three variables, just leave it for three and you can check the variable that you need. For this case, I don't want to create a new variable because I just want to save the file. And then if you want to put a password into your file, check the encrypt file with password. And when you click the save button, the encrypt file dialog box will appear and you want and you need to put the password. And I don't want to put the password into my file. So I uncheck the encrypt file with password and then click save. Now I have the new file that contains the data file from my SPSS working file. Now, you can also transform or convert this data file into another format. Still, go to File, choose Export, and you will see several lists of another format that you can choose your file into. You can save your file into Excel, CSV, or Stata, or whatever you need that Excel provide. In this case, let's export this file into Excel format. Click Excel and choose the location in the Look In tab. And still like the before, you can set the variables that you want to save in the variable tabs and it will create a new file. And you can change the name also. And everything's good, then click Save. Let's see the folder and we can save and convert the file from the SAV format into Excel format that you can open it into Microsoft Excel. And then let's take a look at the output window. So this is the window that contains all the results of our statistical and analysis process. We can save it also into a different format. The format is .spv. To save it, go to File, Save As, and in the Login tab, choose the file where you want to put it, and you can change the name. Uh, data new, new output, and then you can also encrypt it if you want to encrypt and give a password but I don't want to do this and it just click save now this output is safe in the place that you want we have the separate file from the, uh, the data and also the output and then let's convert this output into another format such as PDF or PPT or maybe doc format Go to File, Export, and then in the Type tab, you can choose the converted format that you want. You can save it into PDF, PPT, or you can even save it into Word format, or whatever you need. In this case, let's save it into PDF format, and choose the location. I will save it in the new saving folder. The file name is new output uh, data. 
click save and everything is good okay and then click okay wait until the exporting progress is done because i have about 18 our chart and let's take a look at the folder and we have this pdf file that contains our output data from SPSS. it contains the same and exact chart that already exported into pdf maybe if you want to export the file the output file into another format such as pdf or ppt or whatever it is you can do this by doing the same thing click file and export and choose the file type so that's it now you know how to save your file and export your file into another format hope this video will be useful for you see you in another video